I'm Patrick Capiello from Ravel Restaurant in New York City, and today I'm going to talk about three great wines for your Valentine's Day celebration. So this is Chateau Colomb Segur, a wine from the Bordeaux region in France. It's a pretty traditional wine made in the region, and it's a region that is most famously the Valentine's Day wine consumed by Japanese people. I, and I never understood why, and then I looked a little closer to the label and I noticed that there's actually a heart on the front of the label. And this is the reason why it's their preferred wine to celebrate their romantic Valentine's Day celebration. And I think it's a great option for Valentine's Day, but I wouldn't be eating any sushi with it. Maybe something like Kobe steak grilled up. So the next wine is Chameau Misigny in Burgundy. This is a wine made by a guy named Christophe Rumier, who's one of the great producers of wine in all of Burgundy. The village is Chameau Misigny, but the vineyard is Les Amoureux, and Amoureux means the lovers. So it's often a wine that people will drink on Valentine's Day. For dinner with uh, on Valentine's Day, something simple like roast chicken or even like pot roast, something like that, something hearty and simple. So this last wine is a California winemaker named Jolie Laid, and this is his Love Grenache. You see down here, barely can read it in the bottom, but it does say love. And that's obviously a very loving and romantic picture on the front of a friend of mine who's not wearing a shirt and taking a shower. I'm not quite sure how that translates to love, but it does make you feel happy when you look at it. I would pair it with something like a pork shoulder or a duck breast, something like that. <laughs> now I'm not rubbing his nipple, you crazy? <laughs> There's that socorata starting to develop. Yeah, it looks amazing. Keep adding a little bit of liquid in the center where it evaporates the fastest. That'll help cook that clam open. I'm gonna throw some of the scallions on top. Another thing about paella, people look for that socorata right away. You've gotta let it cool off.